Now we will draw three circle inside a circle. We will take any radius. So first you draw a circle and just draw horizontal and vertical line. Now see this, we have to draw three circles inside a circle. So 360 is the full angle and you have to draw three circles. So 360 divided by 3 will be how much? 120 degree. Right? Now you divide 120 degree divided by 2. How much it will be? 60 degree. So now protractor, you take 60 degree on this side as well as downside. Means you have to take 60 degree on upside as well as downside. Then you draw a vertical line passing through this point A. Extend line like this. Move hmm. this point as 1 and 2. Now what you have to do? You have to bisect angle O, 1 and A. Wherever it will intersect, that we can write as point 3, and take 3 to A, draw a circle. Now, same way we will take 4 to 3, take the same radius from here. So just now we did three circles inside a circle. Now we'll see four circles inside a circle. Now you draw any one circle, and let's say if you want to draw four circles inside this, so 360 divided by 4 will be how much? 90. Okay. And 90 divided by 2 will be how much? 45. So you draw horizontal line and vertical line. You will take 45 degree from here. As well as 45 degree from upside, and you will draw vertical line. Now you bisect this angle wherever it will intersect. From there you can draw one circle. Take O to one. You draw another circle from here. You extend this line as well as this line. This is point two. This is point three. This is point four. Got it. So now in this case, what we are going to do? We are going to draw five circles inside a circle. So 360 divided by 5 will be how much? 72. Divided by 2 will be how much? 36. So first we we'll draw a horizontal line. And vertical line. We will take 36 upward and let's downward vertical line you take this much R cut on this side and then we'll cut on this side. So we have divided circle into five parts. If you want to write, you can write A, B, 
C, D, E. This is O5 divided, circled into 5 parts. Now what I have to do? I have to bisect angle M, N, O. We got a first circle. Now to draw a second circle, what we have to do? We have to bisect this angle A O E. Or what we can do? We can take this much arc, cut on this side. So we got the bisector also. This is center bar. Hmm. So we have drawn five circuits inside a circuit. Now, if you want to draw six circles inside a circle, then same method. You draw a circle. Three sixty divided by six will be how much? Sixty degree divided by two will be how much? Thirty degree. Same method, follow the same method, take 30 30 degree and divide the circle into 6 equal parts and follow the same procedure. 